Welcome to Float State. So you're about to float for the first time. And before you do, a few tips will ensure you have the best experience possible. Before floating, try to avoid caffeine for two to three hours. Try not to be too hungry or too full. And avoid shaving on that day. Please arrive 20 minutes before your appointment so you can complete your waiver and avoid being rushed into your float. When you enter the room, close and lock the door. You'll shower before and after your float. For your first shower, please make sure the water is cool to prevent feeling cold in the skin temperature float solution. Use only body wash and shampoo to remove any fragrance or product before entering the tank. Please save conditioner for after your float as it comes off like an oil in the water. And please be sure to rinse all body wash and shampoo off before getting in the tank. After your shower, before you get in the tank, dry your face as best you can. And now you're ready to enter the tank. As you open the door, you'll see a fresh water spray bottle and washcloth. These are there in case you get salt in your eyes during your float. You can sit up, spray your face, and then dry off with the washcloth. As you lie back in the tank, the water will pop you up and you will be floating effortlessly. Once you are comfortable, it is important to relax your neck. Because your brain is not used to being able to float, it may try to hold tension in your neck to keep your head up. If you have a neck injury, there is a pillow that can be put behind your head. Otherwise, we don't recommend you use a pillow as the goal is to fully release tension as you relax into your float. It may take some time to fully relax into your float. The key is trying to relax your body as much as possible. So just breathe and every time you exhale, feel like you're just letting tension go. You are always in control of the light in your tank during your float. You can keep the light on while you float or you can turn it off and there will be nothing. No light, no sound, just your heartbeat and your breath. If you lie still, eventually you will lose sensation of the water around you. At the end of your float, the music will come on to let you know it's over. If you fall asleep and miss the music, after about two minutes, a light and the filter will come on and it will let you know. Give yourself a second to readjust before exiting the tank. Then you can take a second shower to wash off the salt. After you shower and dress, there is a post float ready room with lotion, Q-tips, vanity mirror, and hair dryer so you can leave ready to hit the town. Relax in the post float lobby and enjoy a cup of tea. Please let us know if you have any questions or comments about your experience and enjoy your post float glow.